real quick, I want to show you how to copy an ad group. And you can do the same thing with a campaign if you want to duplicate a campaign, at least all the settings inside it. It's real simple. So we have this like test ad group number one, a dummy ad group set up here. We can highlight it here, checking it, and then going under edit, and then clicking copy. And then we can simply highlight this ad group and say paste. So you're just doing a copy and paste. It says new ad group pasting. You say paste it. So you're copying the ad group and all the settings in it as far as the ads, the keywords, everything that's set up. And then you'll see that you've added it here into the ad group and it starts out paused and then you can activate it and then you can do all kinds of stuff. So all the settings are the same. You can also cut and paste um, ad groups to uh, moving, adding them to another campaign or to adding them to another ad group uh, as far as the, the, the keywords and ads and everything. So you can copy and paste, cut and paste, do all those things. Just be very, very careful uh, when you do so, especially like cutting and pasting. I prefer to copy and paste because cutting, you're actually removing um, the ad group or the campaign that you're trying to move. Now, one thing you do have to know about uh, copying campaigns and ad groups is that whatever the new copy is, like when you make a new version of it, like if you copy an ad group, that second ad group, like the one we just made, it does not carry over the statistics that the original one had. So there's no simple way right now to actually move like an ad group into a different campaign and keep all the statistics. So you're just copying and pasting, you're duplicating it, but it's remaining in the same campaign. So this is an important note because if you are finding that you have certain uh, ad groups, certain keywords targeted that are super valuable, that are generating a lot of incredible stats and of course a lot of great conversions and profitability for your business, you'll want to move them into a new campaign, copy them to a new campaign, pause the old version, and then run them from the new campaign so you have more control over it uh, as soon as you possibly can uh, because you can't move the data. So you'll want to, you know, as soon as you establish some good data, if you can, and you want to move it to a different campaign, uh, or I should say start it up in a new campaign, copy it over there, and then pause the old one, and then run the new one, but the data doesn't transfer. Uh, you know, Google needs a better way to actually move the data if you're gonna move things around. Um, but from what I found, there's, there's no easy way. Maybe there's a workaround for it. Uh, but you can copy and paste to create a whole new version of an ad group and its ads. Uh, in diff in, if you set up a new campaign, you can copy and paste an ad group over into that new campaign. So you can do these things so they really shortcut your time so you're able to start new campaigns, new ad groups, and not have to put in, you know, type in the ad that's been working so well for you in one ad group, so you don't have to retype it and change the destination URLs and all those things. Uh, you can just, you know, copy them over to a campaign and then just go in and edit the keywords or the other, other settings, of course, that you have, and then that's how you do it.